In this game, you will encounter a variety of visual effects that may provoke seizures or loss of consciousness in a minority of people. If you or someone in your family has ever displayed symptoms of epilepsy in the presence of flashing lights, please consult your physician before playing Cyberpunk 2077. If you or someone you know experiences any of the above symptoms while playing, stop and seek professional medical help. Hello there, kids. It is I, Stray Cat, the one and only, coming to you with another episode of Cyberpunk 2077. Now, I know what you're thinking. Where's the video on the Xbox One version? I have decided that that video shall be a one-off and it shall be its own separate thing. That will require a lot of editing. And there's a reason behind that. It's still so bad. <laughs> it's still so bad. I decided I would try from the start with a new character. And it... I turned off the nudie filter because I figured, you know what, I'm playing this on my own. Why not? Uh... And the moment you load in in-game, the first thing you see is the body all nude, and then the rest of it phases in. At least that was my experience. <laughs> so, um, yeah. <laughs> that is, that is a thing. Um, so, I'm going to going to make that an, its own thing um it's still in the middle of editing right now um i'm working on it on and off uh between regular episodes because oh boy there's just there's so much there's so much that needs to be covered anyway um <laughs> that was to address anyone concerned about why the other video isn't up yet uh, when we left off, we had just gotten done doing the powwow with, uh, Dex and T-Bug. And, of course, we had, uh, we had, uh, fuck. <laughs> I feel so bad because I forgot his name. Uh, shit. Uh, man, I feel so bad that I forgot his name. It's been so long. It's been so long. Um... Fuck. Um. God damn. It's so bad. It's so bad. Man, it's so bad. I forgot. I forgot his name. I feel so bad. But. <laughs> it's fucking. Can I get it? Can I get. Fucking. It, some sort of. Hint. Eh. Uh. Got us a gig. Come on. Give me a gig. Give me a fucking. Hint, man. Oh, uh, shit. <laughs> I forgot his name and I feel so bad because he's one of the cool guys. Oh, uh, shit. Uh, <laughs> just remember the big names. Uh, okay, so after that little powwow, we're supposed to move on from there. Um, and go to the actual job and do the job. So there we go. You ready? Jackie! Jackie, okay. Yeah, I'm ready. Let's go, Jackie. Let's get in and start doing the whole thing. The what? Up, up, up. Okay. Welcome on board this Delamain service. With Delamain, you leave your problems at the door. Son of a bitch. Better fucking believe I will. Yeah. I see no reason why you should be using expletives. Oh. Yeah. What about that time I wanted to hire you for my cousin's bachelor party, huh? Unfortunately, we do not take on such contracts. Three months I'd been saving up scratch. Mm hmm. Yeah, well, yeah, it's what it is. under the bridge. Hit it, Del. Before we begin our journey, I must verify the identities of all customers. Okay. Please proceed to connect your personal links. Alrighty. There you go. Nope. That's weird. All right. Thank you. Excelsior package activated. Cool. Excelsior? 
Oh, this just keeps getting better. Damn right. Excelsior. The Excelsior is a package tailored to our premium clientele. Hmm. The quality don't come free, you know. Now watch. Delamate, initiate combat mode. My apologies, but you do not appear to be in any sort of imminent danger. Huh. Oh well. Trust me. Huh. You'll mow down an army of Zaka ninjas if it comes down to it. That's good to know. This combat mode even legal? Of course it is. The Second Amendment says so. Oh, for fuck's sake. <laughs> While on board, you are entirely within your rights to bear and use me. Okay, that's fair. Excelsior, what else is included? Comprehensive health coverage, including the handling and disposal of a client's remains should death occur on board. Damn. Shit got dark pretty quick. Yeah, well... I, I expected that. Dex ain't skimping, is he? He's taking seventy percent of the pot, or have you forgotten already? Oh yeah, that's right. He is taking seventy percent. This is how you want to cruise into the major leagues. I mean, is that really your be all and end all? Yeah. Huh? Dex managed to buy you off that cheap with a suit, a limo? No, Jack. Kinda of feels like you're losing that steel grip of yours. Huh. Seems to me like it's you who's got some kind of problem. We are nearing our destination. We need you to keep your head clear and in the game. We got a job to do. It's never, ever been clear in my whole fucking life. Alright. Let me explain something to you, V. My whole life I've spent in this shit around us. Mm -hmm. I going back. Okay. All right. Hey, how's things? Smooth as fucking sandpaper. We'll be uh pulling up to the hotel soon. Listen, set up a direct encrypted line to guide you through Compeki. V ring Jackie now, see if we're in sync. Can't be too careful. Okay. And? Hmm. Got static. Say something, bug. The greatest crimes issue from a desire for excess and not from necessity. Say what now? Aristotle. Guess you read me then. Yeah, yeah I read you. That is Aristotle. Not so much your Greek friend. Though it was kind of exciting. A little bit. But give it some thought. Try to understand. How about you, V? I want more Aristotle. Fuck off, both. <laughs> <laughs> okay. Tech checks out, looks like. Stay in touch. Thank you for choosing the Delamain service, and best of luck. I shall await here for your return. Thank you. It's finally happening. Yeah, it is. Almost forgot. No iron, huh? Yeah, no iron. Put All right. that gun there. Hey, let's go. All right. Arasaka waterfront. Let me grab the flathead. Okay. Wait for Jackie to take the flathead. And follow Jackie. Alrighty. We're out front, Bug. Member, reservations in your name, Ramon. Ramon. You're there to meet Hajime Taki, military Welcome tech to department rep. Papers are for the flathead. Don't worry. Got this. Okay. Welcome to Compeki Plaza. Please come through single file. Okay. You got it, home. Uh, <clears throat> sir? <laughs> Almost busted this fucking thing. Hold on. Got something. You got something. Sir, care to explain why you're bringing a combat bot onto Compeki Plaza premises? I don't intend to explain myself to you or anyone else. Actually, we have rules, see? And they say you have to. Ah, you are here to see Taki-san, am I right? Yeah, correct. Please, accept my apologies for the confusion. No worries. <laughs> All right. This should only take a moment, sir. Yeah? Go ahead. Thank you. Do appreciate Yo, it. Yo, Greetings and welcome to Kompeki Plaza. Ohio. 
because it's morning for me, I can say that. We'd like to check in. Of course. Just a moment, please. Is this actually a robot? It's hard to say. Victorino. Double room, two adults, one night, correct? Mm -hmm. That's the one. Perfect. I'll go ahead and notify Takistan of the arrival. Okay. Shit, no good. Not part of the plan. Talk her up, V. Stall. That won't be necessary. We'll go freshen up first. Notify him ourselves. But Takisan is expecting you. No? Senorita, mm -hmm. you know how long we've been traveling? 18 hours from New Barcelona. With a delay on Medici because some cyber cycle blew himself into bits inside the terminal. Oh, a nightmare. Yeah. Of course, I understand. You'll be in the Lapis Lazuli suite on level 42. Level oh, 42. Oh, one more little formality. Please validate your SID chip. Okay. Here's all yours, Harry. Thank you, Ramon. Being order. We wish you a pleasant stay. Thank you. Better get going. Yeah, let's get going. Okay, camera right there. Really? It's called improvising. You should try it. I mean, to be fair, that was pretty quick what do you on his think, feet. Harry? Hmm? Quaint, cozy. Not like the hotel we had in Zurich for that convention. Don't need that, Jack. Enough. What? He's taking this seriously. He is. He's taking it more seriously than I would have. Because by this point, I would have shut the fuck up. But, you know, he's already shown he's quick on his feet. I don't know, man. The bar don't look too shabby. No, it don't. Welcome this looks pretty to damn Confetti good. Plaza. Hi there. We don't do reservations weekdays, so feel free to grab any available table. Or a couple of stools at the bar if you prefer. Could bring Misty here one day when we uh, close this deal. Wouldn't hurt to take a peek inside. Yeah, it wouldn't hurt. Yet. Like some fucking traveling salesman with this case. Well, I mean, upstairs. you do that. I'm gonna hang around here. Just hang around. And when I say heads are gonna roll, I don't mean it as a fucking turn of phrase. Had enough, guy? Don't you think? Making the other customers uncomfortable. A little bit. Yeah, these these right. guys are robots. This affects them too. It'll slap everyone in the face. Uh Or keeps right. You've had your fill for today. Hmm. Guess so. Besides, what's a man supposed to do? I'm gonna get some sleep. Go ahead, do that, man. Relax. Evening. Evening. These are I get really you? convincing androids, I gotta admit. Let's see what you got. Of course. Of course. Ooh, Spunky Monkey. <laughs> That's a name. Sake Ugata Utagawa. I, I was transposing syllables there. Uh, Sake Utagawa. Pretty decent. It's also specifically booze. The perfect gift to yourself. If only that was true. Only 200 bottled claim yours. The Chateau de Laine 2012. Damn. 2077. That's pretty old vintage. Guess damn. Okay, the Absinthe. Be Bohemian. <laughs> I gotcha. The Abdos Classic. Some things should never change. Abdos king size, sometimes only a king can satisfy. <laughs> All right, okay. Shut up now. Uh, Armagnac Masi. Don't drink it. Savor it. The Brosif Ale. <laughs> hey, Brosif, an ale of a beer. Hey, hand me a Brosif. Okay. Let's shut up now. Sensuan Totoxtin. That fucking, that's a name and a half. I ain't going to get it. Tequila with no equal. Well, there's no wonder I wasn't going to get the name right. Uh, Papa Garcin. Hey-ho and a bottle of rum. Hell yeah, give me that. 
Look at this though. Old Dick and Whiskey. <laughs> Old Dick and Whiskey. Okay. Whiskey. Anything else is just frills. Oh, some coffee. More coffee. It's decaf. Actual coffee. And the milkshake. Daring Dairy Milkshake. With authentic milk flavor. <laughs> you mean to tell me they ain't doing milk no more? Nah, I don't believe you. I don't believe you. I'm going to buy a rum, because I do not see why not. Might as well get something I will enjoy. Get enough to up to two pounds. Why not? Get about eight. That's fine. And that'd be 240. I have 9,000. That ain't too bad. I could do that. Nice. Whoop. Well, okay, now my inventory fucking pops up. Hello. Um. There we go. Thank you. The what? Tiancha pomegranate. Okay. Okay. Vatna ko <laughs> Vatna Shokul. Sparkling. Okay, that is a fucking hell of a name. Can't you see I'm busy? Doing what? I mean, fair, but... You sure about that? Yeah. Right, yeah. Bosch, a Manet, two Basquiat miniatures, nothing All sucked out into the empty void of space through a hole in the station's body. Bloody hell. What will become of the gallery? Oh, but it was all planned. The focus of the whole opening. Oh, wait, what? wait. Allow me to venture a guess. A new Abramovsky? Mm-hmm. Untitled number three. It's a reckoning with... Oh, I can't remember. God, I think. Sounds ambitious. How much did it cost? The gratitude of an artist of his stature is worth more. Okay. I'll take your word on it for that. You seem to be the only human at the bar. I don't know you, so let's keep it that way. Okay, also, that's the case. I'm wondering if you're on the, even the right side of the bar. I don't know. Yeah, most of the... I'm, I'm noticing that most of the staff seem to be robots. And like, actual robots. Like, no skin, no nothing sort of robots, unless they specifically wanted to get that sort of skin. Don't know why. Look like a goddamn doll. Mannequin, really, more like. Oh, that would set off Markiplier or something fierce. Okay. Alright, let's head up to the apartments where I'm supposed to be. Wait, isn't this a hotel? Okay, well, fuck it, whatever. Por que no las dos? I guess. Hey, there you are. Hey, what's up? About time. You good? I guess they're good. Okay. I just wanted to get a few drinks. I wanted to get myself some rum. To help celebrate a little. Ты же помнишь, как мы тестировали эту технику на наших. Про заражение под Новоиркутском они okay. про аварию на Баконинской 3 врали. Они всегда врут. То есть он тоже? Охренеть. Okay. They're speaking some heavy Russian. We're in our room. Pretty snazzy. Too bad we ain't staying the night. Nice choice, Buck. Didn't pick it for snaz. Offers quickest access to the dweller and servers. Si, si, me acuerdo. <laughs> now you fire up the flathead and find the shaft entrance. Sounds simple enough. Mm -hmm. Simplicity is sometimes toughest to master. That really? is. Aristotle? Who's it this time? Yours truly. That one's mine. Nice. Where's the shaft? Boot up your scanner. <laughs> Look around. Uh, there's a joke in that phrase somewhere. Flathead prep to go? Almost there, Colonel. Alright, sounds good. Scan for an entry point for the flathead. That is definitely not it. That's just a TV. Got a winner. Yeah, yeah, we do. Jackie, how's the flathead looking?
And in it goes. And out it goes. Systems are operational. Charge at 100. Wait for the flathead to breach the system. Yeah, the little gonk stuck. Oh. Just gonna stand there and look at it? Gonna have to switch to manual control. V, take the control shard from Jackie. I'm gonna link your Kiroshis to surveillance so you can guide the bot. Okay. Surveillance cover the whole hotel. Mm-hmm. Even the bedrooms in the suites. Guests don't care. You're, what? You'd be surprised what people are willing to give up to feel secure. Okay. Lucky for well, us, your Nobu is an exception. Penthouse is dark. No hotel security. That is lucky. Why me? Why do I got to slot it in? Unlike someone, I haven't run on my tab with Vic. Got last-gen firmware. No flow. Just do it, bro, there. Ain't got all day. All right, all right, Fato. All right. Here. Let me do it. Here goes. Patching you through to in camp view. Might get a little disoriented, but don't freak. Okay. Oh, wowzers. All right. Okay. Okay, got a clear view. You can't just go locking people out of their homes. Get them to the next vent. Places of work. Arasaka will cover the cost of any and all penalties assessed. Mm. This isn't about the money. It's election season. How do you think this will make me look? People start saying I've lost control of once. District I'm from. A week. That's all we can promise you. We will try. And that is all I can promise you. Oh, really? Well, of course. Backroom dealings with politics and corporations, of course. Okay, flathead's in. All right. Patching you into next cam now. All right. Housekeeping. What makes you think it was for you? He addressed it to the kind housekeeper who finds him. Note inside said, "Sorry for the mess." Oh. There was blood everywhere. But at least he left a tip. Am I the only one that just gets puke and used condoms? Where's the damn justice in it? Oh! A uh, bug? Got a hitch. What now? Think he's Housekeeping's single? in my way. Who? Okay, got a distractor. Uh, let's see what's on the subnet. Has that no right, look in his it. eye? He's staying in the penthouse. Stand for hackable Senior devices. Senior Noble Arasaka. Men like him are always single. Might wear expensive suits, but he's a biker at heart, always mm, looking for a no, ride. Not in the least. <laughs> I'd give him Drarian's a Terrarium's got a temp and air quality controller. Cream, yeah. Honey, Sink the flathead on stick it. Stick to wiping that glass, huh? You're leaving streaks everywhere. So, someone off themselves in this room, and the housekeeper that found it was allowed to get the tip for offing themselves, I guess. Uh, cat. Something's up with the tank. Hey, Bug, it worked. <laughs> Can't say nothing yet. You got any idea how much those things cost? Keep moving. No time for backpatting. Yeah, yeah. No, I know. All right, Flathead, move it. Move it, move it, move it, move it. Move it. it ain't gonna distract them for long. There you go. Okay. You are here. Get you through that. Seems to be just some sort of locker room. Okay. What? Dwellers just oh. beyond the door. Flathead can jimmy the lock. Oh, really? Uh, why, why am I directly controlling it now? Oh, wait. Oh, no, I'm not. I am not at all. It was over there. Didn't know that, because I didn't see it. Looks like he's having trouble. Shit. Gotta be another way. Let me think. Got another cam other side of the door, but it's disabled. Want me to enable? Yeah. Look around for a CCTV port. Is that it? Got yes, it is. Okay, have the flathead jack in. Okay. Let's do it. 
Okay, he's at it. Now toggle over to the other camp. Dolores okay. inside. I'm here. Just as planned. Still weird though. Tells only got one runner. Decent dwellers as good as a dozen rank and file. Flathead ought to be able to neutralize him. Good thinking. Let me graft a demonoid onto your link. And you know you gotta jack the flathead directly into his chair, right? Make it sound like I'm new at this. Okay, sent. He's all yours. You'll have to get the flathead in there first, though. Okay. Shaft may link both rooms, looks like. Let's figure it out. Now toggle over to the other camp. Okay. And, aha! Uh -huh. Yes, it does. Way in. Send the flathead over there, then toggle over to the second camp. And there's the net runner. Once we get through. Flathead into the chair, V. Jack in. Now I know what I'm doing. Model 543XRS. 128 teraflops. Holy fuck. Full root access. Alright. Let's knock him out, Flathead. Flathead stays, right? To keep an eye on the dweller, yeah. Punching okay. into Kopecky's main net. You go ahead and log out. Okay. And out we go. Así es como se hace. Hey. How you feeling? <laughs> Fine. A little dizzy, that's all. Bug, how you doing on time? You there, Bug? Yeah, yeah, I'm here. So, um, listen, ice is thicker than I thought. Piercing it'll take a couple hours. Oh, God. A couple damn. hours? Can't do it any faster. Want my brain to burst into flames? Just sit down and enjoy your snazzy sweet. Thanks. I will. V, you take it easy, okay? Rest up a bit. Uh-huh. I'll rest up a little bit. Yeah. Not like you don't want to. Nuh-uh. All right, let's check what we got when it comes to perks, huh? Perks and all that. Um, intelligence. That actually, actually, that actually ended up helping me out there a little bit. Coming up with that idea. Um, technical ability. Let's up that. Uh, first things first. Crafting is all maxed out. At least as far out as I'm going to be able to get it. Um, grenadier. Can't touch this. I'm already good at. Explosion radius of grenades is visible. That would be nice. That would be very useful and very nice. Very nice. Um, mech looter. Ooh. Looting a weapon mod or attachment. That would be nice. That would be very nice. Hmm. Excuse me. Stomach's giving me uh, shiaiza right now. Mm. I don't know though. I don't know. Let's look into if there's anything here I might like. Regeneration was a good idea. Invincible was a good idea, but I don't know if I can push this any further. I could. Increasing max health by 20% would be helpful. Stamina, mm, not really running into any problems with that. I'm not running into any problems with capacity. Annihilation. Reduces recoil of shotguns and light machine guns. Uh, shotguns and light machine guns deal 3% more damage. Oh, so this is what deals with uh, shotguns and machine guns. Okay, that makes sense. Reduces reload time. Weird that it isn't in... Uh, it isn't uh, same spot with all the other weapons. But uh, I guess it makes sense. I guess. Street Brawler. Increases uh, armor by 15% while blocking with a blunt weapon. Or I'm assuming with my fists. I guess that's probably just as good. Blunt weapons. Blunt weapons. Blunt weapons. Do my hands count as blunt weapons? I would hope so, considering. Um, hmm.
I'd have, I'd have to I'd have to look into that real quick before I decide on doing that. But that would be good. Would be good to have. Um while that is tempting, I'm not entirely sure I'm willing to put that in. Hard motherfucker. Alright, that's a hell of a name of a perk. Okay. Hmm. Perk requires level 20 in athletics. Jesus. Alright. Um. Cool. Cold blood. Let's look into that. Silent and deadly. Allows you to throw knives. That is pretty good. Hidden dragon. Non-lethal aerial takedowns on unaware targets. Increases movement speed while sneaking. Crouching tiger. Well, you sold me just on the name of the perk. <laughs> what can I say? I'm a simple man. I'm a simple cat, really. <laughs> give me give me the name of my species. I'm I'm gonna go for it. I'm gonna go for it. No doubt on that. Hmm. Cold blood. After defeating an enemy, gain cold blood for ten seconds and increase movement speed by two. Stacks up to one time. Hmm. Interesting. Reduces weapon recoil by 2.5% per stack. Re increases all resistances by 2.5% per stack. And that goes for 10 seconds. That might be something I want to go into next. Keep raising next. Right now, I am unequipped of everything, even though I don't want to be. <laughs> These aren't going to be visible while I'm in my Militech suit. So, Alright. It's time to sit, because that's all I really can do for the time being. Uh, a few hours later. Okay. What do you Things think? Move. Why'd you give it all up? Who gave what up? Yorinobu Arasaka. The good life, I mean. Oh. Old news, I know. Just got to thinking, so. Mm -hmm. It's like, think. You got everything, right? Eddie's yeah. education. Mm -hmm. Your pops can snap his fingers and turn half the fucking planet into a nuclear wasteland. But instead, you're like, mm -hmm. nah, fuck it. And what do you go do? Start a fucking gang. <laughs> Steal dragons. Oh, shit. You ghost from your fam, chip some real skin, and play gang leader for a few years. For what? Ah, fuck him. Why do I need to care about some bougie prick and his street kid fantasies? <laughs> Must have been a who, huh? I'm Yorinobu Arasaka. Would you folks like to join my gang? Poser with court protection. <laughs> and the name, too. Steel fucking dragons? Oh, man. A wannabe gang goon's wet dream. Got bored of being rich and then got bored of playing tough. <laughs> Fucking tourist. Yeah. Tourist or not, he just walked into the lobby. Oh. And we are back in biz. Penthouse security is neutralized. Good. Perfecto. Let's start the show. Hey, All Buck. Right. Where are uh, Were you on comms that whole time? Three and a half hours. Uh... About that stick up the ass. Means the one up mine? Yeah, <laughs> uh, slip of the tongue, you know? I know. Now's your chance to make up to me. Well, that is very nice. Alright. Time to head up to the penthouse floor. I'm waiting for you, bud. Let me close the door. There we go. Tavernier suite. Okay. Authorization uh, control. The awkward silence. You uh, wanna hear a joke? Now. Really? Seriously. Okay. So why'd the rocker boy's output kick him out of the apartment? Because he 
wasn't chipping in. <laughs> Jesus Christ. <laughs> Not bad being heir to the Arasaka Empire. Yeah. Sure is shit better than being a son of Raul Wells. Guys, focus. The safe. Yeah. Just make it quick. Okay. Why? What's the rush? Sing on your Nobu's gone dark. Oh. What is he, a fucking sorcerer? Some kind of dead zones, my guess. Have him back in a sec. And you do your damn job. There, under the floor. Look around for a switch. Around for a switch, huh? Um, scan for a hidden switch. Okay, not there. Ooh. It'll tell me. How about that? That switch is right by the bed. Of course it is. I'm right. Hey. Got something ejected. Come here, V. Oop, oop, I got stuck on something. Okay. Oop, gotta read this real quick since it popped up. For years, experts in the field of cybernetics, neurology, and psychology have been desperately trying to merge human consciousness with silicon. Until now, their efforts have been unsuccessful. Though scientists have managed to create artificial intelligences that can compare, or indeed, surpass human intellect, copying the human eye has remained beyond our capabilities. Attempts to do so have merely resulted in sophisticated chatbots, digital beings capable of mimicking human speech and mannerisms, but devoid of self-awareness. Today, experts from Arasaka announced a breakthrough, their newest project, dubbed The Relic, allows human minds to be copied onto shards no larger than a cred chip. What's more, the shard can be slotted into one's neural port, allowing its user to hear and see digitized personality constructs. Sadly, I haven't been able to personally examine the specifications of this remarkable piece of technology. Access to the relic is heavily restricted by Arasaka, and only a small, select group of testers are allowed to participate in the program. Unsurprisingly, these testers are among the wealthiest and most influential people in the world. Precisely the kinds of people Arasaka would like to have in its pockets. For the ordinary consumers reading this, don't expect the relic to hit mass markets anytime soon. That sounds about right. What now? Jack in your personal and make us rich. Okay. Aye. Your turn, bug. Give me two. Okay. Wow, that is taking a while. Oh, son of a bitch. We got winged visitors. Bug. Uh, don't know who, but staff's a buzz. All 200 on their feet can't keep still. Can't say I like this. Something's up. How much longer, T? Shit, you're a Nobu's penthouse bound. Son of a Fuck bitch. Him. Open the safe. Almost got it. Done. Preem. Okay. Got it. Relic intact? <laughs> Flashed in and out. 100%. Guessing that's a yes. Good. Let's go. Let's get out of here. Fuck. Too late. Your Nobu's about to walk in. Find cover. Where? That pillar. Try that. You fucking kidding? No. Inside it now. Okay. Oh boy. We're in. Which don't solve our problem, T. No, it do not. I know our problem's still there. Let me think for a sec, okay? Let's not I don't smash her. Bodyguard. Wars. Night City. Bleep, motherfucking one too. What's the play? We wait. Are they here yet? They approach from the landing pad. Fuck are they talking about? Bug, who we got incoming? Nuh uh, no fucking way. This isn't happening. Um. Saburo Arasaka. What? The Emperor. Yet another ass licking legend. Shush. Doubt this could be soundproof. He's just sitting there squeezing it. He's... Could 
That I told you not to meddle in my affairs. Oh, fuck. Arasaka-sama, I still haven't done a full sweep. This is my son. Of course, should I retrieve what I, we came here to, I will handle it. You may go. Okay. Oh, I was too close. close. If he'd have sniffed us out, but he didn't. No, Kaya did. You want to talk? Unfucking believable. Saburo Arasaka. Of all people. Did you think I would know it was taken from me? Actually, I don't think of you at all. Ever. You see, that's your problem. You think the world revolves around you. Arrogant. Yorinobu. Why did you come? To humiliate me? To personally see to it that your son knows his place? The nail that protrudes from the wall gets hammered. Couldn't think of anything original to say. And do you think it original to sell our greatest achievement to the Westerners, our future to these barbarians? <laughs> our future? Ours? You're mistaken. You've only ever cared about yourself and your six schemes. I knew this day would come, and that sooner or later, your impudence would cross the line. There was much for which we, I could forgive you, but for treason, no. I'm just glad your mother didn't live to see this. The heart should break but once. You shall never have to forgive me for anything again. So he's just gonna murk his father in front of us. Okay, all right. Holy fuck, dude. 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 Dude, that is your dad, man. I don't care how bad a fucking family situation you have, that's fucked, man. Someone poisoned my father. Poisoned? It seems so. You're Nobu-san. I doubt What is your job, Takemura? I don't follow. It's a simple question. Answer it. To protect the head of the Arasaka family, I do sincerely hope you'll do a better job of executing your duties from now on. Forgive me, Arasaka-san. I shall not disappoint you. What the fuck just happened in there? 
just offed Saburo. What? You heard me. Don't fucking pops. You know what this means? Security's gonna swarm the place any second. Oh my god, we're so fucked. V, it's time for thinking. Time for getting the fuck out. Let's go. Bug, need you get us out of here now. Give me a sec. We don't have a sec. Fuck. Okay, got something. Window now. Window now. Window now. Okay. Releasing the lock. Should see a ladder. Ladder. Oh fuck. Oh no 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 not now. What do you mean not now? Fuck. Pichido Santo Bendito. Just lost T. Fuck. Fucking major leaks. Happy now, Jackie. Yeah, do not look down. Yep. That's fucking high. Oh, yeah, it is. Shit. That trauma? Yes, that's they're trauma. They're here for Saburo. They're a little late. Just a little. Just hope they didn't see us. Well, all we can do is hope. Ah. Time to jump. Okay. All right. Oh. Well, that didn't go as planned at all. Oh no. Oh shit! Nope. Close nope. One. It's fucked. The relic! Madres! Oh, oh this ain't good. How's the biochip? I don't know. Container depressurized. Biochip integrity at 94%. And look at dropping. Carajo. Chingada. Parker, call her and tell her we fried the case. Just do it. The Kabeki's all over the feeds. What the fuck's going on there? Got a problem. Cryo case is damaged. Biochip's integrity at. Jackie? 86%? 86% and drop it. Shit. Okay, listen to me. There's only one thing you can do. One of you's gotta slot the relic into your neural port. That doesn't sound safe. The longer you wait, the greater the risk we'll lose it. Well, someone's gotta do it. Jackie, no. Jackie, you okay? No, no. I guess. Don't feel any different. Once you're back, we'll take out the relic and run a full brain scan and sweep. But you two need to get the fuck out of there first. Yeah, I'm working on it. This is why we got in this predicament. Hi there, Delamain. Yeah, we'll be there in a couple. Be ready. Got it? Certainly, Mr. Wells. Better be fucking certain. We're gonna somehow reach the lobby. Only chance to hit the garage. And we best be quick. You're not wrong. Oh, what I see. Gray. Let's get out of here. All right. Let's get out of here. Attention. Code red has been initiated throughout Kimpeki Plaza. Clear. Please remain in your room and follow now. all instructions. I ain't got time for this. This was a drill why they send in Saka Special Forces. Take a little quiet. Special Forces. All right. In the lobby now. We're going to sweep the building, all floors. Take them out quiet, eh? For now, got it. 
just because I might need it. Alright. Might actually just take the stuff off of him, too. Alright. Attention! Code Red has been initiated throughout Kenpeki Plaza. Please remain in your rooms and follow all instructions Need to check the Zen Okay. Those two terrace damaged. Then take another look. Okay. Take another look, huh? Well, I can't go that route. Okay, good. Um. Meant to execute remote deactivation. Okay, good. Good on that. And grab. Okay, I'm gonna knock him out. Drag him away. Drag him as far away as I can. And put him right here. Attention. <laughs> Code red has been initiated what an unceremonious fall. Please remain in your and we're going to pick that up. Instructions given by staff. And... Okay. Alright, we're going to go around him. So we seem to have some wiggle room. It is all light over here. God damn it. Okay. So maybe not all the room that I hoped for. But at least there's no cameras between us and him. If there's any kills, it's going to go bad. So we're not even going to bother with kills. What I am going to do is just knock them out and then move them out the way. Nice flop. Alright. Just keep on moving. Keep on moving. That's all we can do. Just keep on moving. Well, okay. optics while well, he's unable to see <laughs> there we go okay a little better than I expected. Alright. And I'm noticing we are way over time, but I don't really care. Right now I'm in the middle of trying to get us out of here. Let him flop. And... Okay. We'll move this body. And then... Move him here. And then drop. Okay! Don't know why... It don't know why I did that maneuver. And did it kill him? I don't know. <laughs> I don't care. I'm going to end this episode. We are going way the fuck over time. Okay. 
Thank you all so much for watching. Click the subscribe button if you like these videos and you want to see more, click the like button if you like this particular video. And share in comments so we can bring more people into this community. We can talk about the games we're playing together and I will see you all in the next episode. This has been the one and only Stray Cat playing games and finally getting through the heist and holy shit has it gone wrong. Boy, it is now really bad. We have now uh, Yorinobu apparently killing his daddy while we were in the middle of the heist and hiding and that we had to watch it. That was really fucking weird. And now we're trying to get out of the hotel while it is on full lockdown because now uh, Sun wants to act like he was poisoned when, in fact, it was him marking his daddy. So this is getting real complicated real quick. Also, apparently T-Bug is out because she has been fried by uh, whoever reactivated the security protocols. So uh, hopefully she's alive and hopefully we are by the end of this for you.